Templars and Tarakons because like Templars without storms is like I don't know they're worthless it's like a girl without like a pussy like she's totally worthless because like why the fuck do you need a girl without an ass or a pussy because like yeah she's useless anyways yeah that's kind of getting off topic and if there are any girls that are watching this I'm kind of just joking around I don't mean you girls are useless if you don't have your reproductive organs it's just I don't know I'm trying to be funny Anyways, yeah, I kept, yeah, bad example. Don't know, if any girls watch this, don't take that offensively, you know. You girls are very good people, I don't know, fuck it. Anyways, yeah, so, now I'm macroing again, because, again, I'm trying to stay low in minerals, except I want to save up some population, because nuclear silo, I think it costs, what, 8 population or 6 population? Uh, yeah, it costs 8 population, and so I needed the, as you can see, my, my supply depot count is 180, 176 out of 176 right now, and so, yeah. I needed the population to build that nuclear silo, and now I'm just getting terrorists everywhere. I just look like he can't like I'm, I just make sure he can't get to my base without attacking the front. And I know he can still recall, except I didn't see a stargate way back when I scanned, and so now I'm just gonna hope he doesn't have a stargate yet. Or if, even if he does, then I, I guess even if he dropped me, like what what's the worst he can do? Take out an expansion, but then I'll be prepared for his drops. I just want to see his main army is over here, and usually you have your orbiters with your main main army. And he doesn't, so I'm just going to take the risk and assume he doesn't have Arbiters. And he has a shitload of army. Like, he probably has a bigger army than me right now. He's probably maxed, I don't know. He could be maxed. But, again, maxed... To beat a Turan Turtle defense, you have to... Uh, uh, Protoss needs to be a good 60, 40 population ahead. Or 50, at least, population ahead. And he's not... E it's impossible to be 50, unless he's somehow mind-controlled one of my SCBs and then started a whole Turan race. And now here's here's the turning point of the game right here. All right, so he's attacking, which is the biggest dumbass mistake in the world. He's not going to kill anything like at all. The maximum he'll kill is all my vultures, but besides that, he'll lose all his zealots and all his dragoons. Right now, I've lost 20 population, and he has lost like uh, I bet you he has lost a good hundred population. Again, you do not attack a pro. Uh, sorry, you do not attack a Turan when when you friggin uh, when the pro you don't you don't attack a Turan when he's camped up. I lost one tank. This whole battle, I lost one tank. And like what, 10, 20 vultures? But who gives a shit about the vultures? They're not that useful either way. But yeah, I lost again, and I just supplemented the tank. The sorry, the vultures that I needed to mine up. And yeah, vultures are also useless without mines, cause like, who the fuck needs vultures without mines? Again, same example. Girls, never mind. Bad example. Anyways, so yeah, um, I'm getting my okay. Yeah, so the hint to, uh, what do you call it? Uh, nuking a Protoss per player is. You basically EMP their nexus, so it take, takes away all their shields, and then you nuclear, you nuke their oh, fucking fuck, damn it. Oh, well, at least it didn't. My main worry was it's saying nuclear launch detected. I just don't want it to re see that I have a nuclear launch uh, ready for rape because I just don't want him to see a nuclear launch because that's the main thing. Then he'll be prepared for it. Right now, I want to catch him off guard with like a few nukes, and if I can do that, that'll really really help me. And now I'm gonna try this one more time. Uh, that last time I was just being stupid and I didn't like click properly and that cost me the thing. You really gotta be precise with your clips if you're clicks if you're trying to do it over a cliff because somehow sometimes y units be gay and they want to go right next to the mineral field and do it some shit like that. So yeah, you really have to be precise with your clicks when you do it and so don't fuck up with your nukes because nukes cost a lot and they're just not worth enough to just like get wasted like that and. Yeah, so now, as you can see, I am building my nuclears and uh, my nuclear silos, and I, I constantly am just gonna keep pumping out more uh, ghosts until I'm, I can't pump out like until like I, until he's like perfectly defended against nukes. And a nuke one hits a uh, uh, nexus as long as you can have EMP goes going along with it, because I'm pretty sure nuke does a thousand damage, and EMP takes out shields, so 750 shields taken out plus a thousand damage, and that's 750 shields and a thousand life, and that's way more. That's a good 250 more than uh, uh, Nexus has, and see as you can see he is trying. To, my probe is my gut thing is trying to be gay. As you can see there, here we go. Okay, I got the nuke off, and now all I need to do is EMP. And yeah, okay, my ah fuck my what? Uh, don't come on EMP, EMP, EMP. Yes, all right, I got the EMP off. That was worth it. Believe me, it was worth it. And I need a scan just to show you guys how the nukes work. Bam! Everything just got fucked up. Oh yeah, that 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 was good. That was good. All right, so I did basically just killed like what twenty probes and a good like a nexus. Again, nukes are worth it as long as you can like tech up slowly to them. I've seen it done in pro games, but not that often. But yeah, it's you just it's just weird. And as you can see, I'm just killing all my tanks because I need supply for like 
my nukes and I, now I'm just fucking around. Like now I know I won. I'm just fucking around now. I'm pretty sure I won. I guess he could still possibly win because I know this guy's really good at macro and he could have a shitload of an army, but I highly doubt he'll win. Just because I've nuked his ass like so many times. And his main's probably out of minerals. So right now he's probably mining from two places and I'm mining from three. And he's supposed to be an expansion ahead again. I've said that enough times. And he isn't, so he's going to keep getting raped with my nukes. And now my second nuke coming up. And again, I'm scanning to see if he has cannons or what here. And he does not have cannons or anything. So I shall be going in for the nuke. And let's see if he can hold this or not. And again, I'm going to EMP his shit so he can't... Uh, what do you call it? I'm going to EMP so he can't... I'm cloaking also. That's the really key if you're doing this. You want to cloak so then they can't just kill off your ghost. I didn't cloak that last time because I was being stupid. But yeah, I'm cloaking this time. And as you can see, now he's going to need to get an observer here. And then he's going to need to get dragoons here and kill it. But by that time, my nuke's going to go off. And there, he, here's the nuke going off. Damn, fuck that base up too. Alright, so now he lost two of his bases. He's down to one base and I'm up to three. And so yeah, he's pretty much fucked as you can see. And look at my force. I have a huge ass vulture good tank force right here. So yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah, this this is over. And now I'm just going to fuck him up pretty well with you. And as you can see, the main reason he lost is because I took the... He tried attacking when I had the middle, and he could not possibly do it. And there's no way he could have won it by attacking the middle. And now he's going to regret attacking because he could have had those units trying to defend. And now I have three hockeys of tanks, and I have, like, what, two hockeys of vultures. And that's... Yeah, I'm not going to siege at all. I'm just going to win without siege. I have three hockeys of vultures, three hockeys of tanks. So if you can... There's no Protoss army. There's no Protoss ground army that can beat this terrain army, guaranteed, no matter what, you can combine any units, you can have mass archons, you still won't win, you can win with carriers, which he does have, which I'm a dumbass, because I have a maxed army with no goliaths, if I was good chancer, I definitely would have had goliaths, and yeah, I'm not going to siege at all, I don't even need to worry about my own base, I can guarantee you, I, mean, I don't need to worry about the army, because there's no protoss army, ground army that can beat this, and sure, those two carriers, they're, they're going to do something, not that much though, and yeah, here's his final force, it's not that much, and again, temps, making it that much harder for him. I just picked off the temp. And here's the one more temp I just need to pick off. And yeah, okay, that temp's dead. So his only two things that were going to do damage on me were those two temps. And that's it. And he says GG, so I say GG. And I'm being good manner, that's why I say it. Not BM, which stands for bad manner. And so now he left. And this is game. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Quick overview of this game. So basically at the starting, I was kind of ahead because he got his gas a little late, but that didn't affect the game that much considering this went into such a long game. And also basically I just um, sat, because I knew this map was really, if you get your third expansion you can basically take the middle and I used the map to my advantage by taking the middle and that made me win, uh, uh, that made me that made him attack the middle because he knew I, he needed to be expansion ahead. And he tried to attack, but he failed, and that cost him mainly the game. If he tried to recall, that would have helped him a lot. That would probably be the thing that would have helped him win. But he did, he he failed to recall, and he basically attacked me. That's the main reason he lost. And he didn't get the other expansions he could have, maybe because he didn't know the map that well. And that's another reason he lost. But if he did all that, I'm pretty sure he could have won. And he, his temper harass was good, but he needed to do a little more. And here we go. Okay, let's nuke all this, just for the hell of it. I'm bored. And that's the overview of this game. And this is all nuked. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Shit. Poor tanks. They're all just going to get fucked up in a few seconds. Poor vultures, tanks, and poor ghost and vessel. That you all guys going to die. Bam! I just lost, like, what? 150 population there? Or 100 population? Anyways. GG, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's pretty much it. Uh, peace out. Look forward to more coming out.